Okay, so basically, um, I was six years old and I had a interesting dream. Basically, it was a nightmare, and I was in this hallway, and this hallway was very long. Um, if I'm trying, it was probably at least a mile, maybe longer. You know, dreams are you can't really judge distance in dreams or anything like that, but um, or time for that matter. Uh, but yeah, I, I basically on every side of me on this hallway, there are a bunch of doors, like every fucking foot or two, there's a door on each side. And I just start flinging them open, six year old me flinging open these doors. And behind each of them is sort of a different landscape. Like in one, there's a mountain range and another, there's like a cave. There's like um, a desert, there's a jungle, etc. Um, Basically, uh, one of them was space, and that was, and it wasn't even pretty space either. It was like just endless black, peppered with the stars. It, the, I don't know. That one basically filled me with a very strong sense of dread, and because of that, because my dream brain was like, "Oh, you're scared now. Here, let me throw a ginormous door at the end of the hall and be like, "Ooh, it's made of metal. It's a really." It's a bolt iron door with a sort of porthole on it. And I, I walk down to the end of the hallway. I'm going to look out this porthole that's perfectly positioned for my six-year-old body to look out of. And I, I, I see what looks to me to be a forest. And I open the door. I open this huge, giant metal door. And it's not a forest. It's the fucking ocean. And I am... F and I am floating in the middle of the ocean because the entire hallway just dis a fucking pier. I'm fucking floating in the open ocean. Can't see the surface. Can't see the bottom. Can't see fucking anything. Just blue. Endless blue. And I start seeing this fucking shape getting out in the fucking distance. And I, it's, it's like moving way too human-like to be an animal. But at the same time, it doesn't look human enough to be a human either. And as it gets closer, I can make out more details. There's a fucking fin on its back. There's like fucking wet, like the webbing between its arms. And it's fucking gross looking. It gets close enough and it's a human shark hyper that attacks me. And I wake up immediately just drenched. And I... I, I I am 100% certain that that is one of the reasons I am afraid of the ocean. Um, the other reason being the cruise I took when I was six, but that's a whole other issue. <laughs> yeah, crazy.